blessed self om namo narayanaya salutations only because i have got more interesting and very useful fields of many other works in hand at present i cannot give you an autobiography but here are some positive points which should satisfy you for the time being later i am sure you will try to shift your attention from me to the rishis and make your life beautiful and sublime i was born in kerala raised in the north hardened in punjab softened in uttarakasi criticized everywhere applauded in some places but accepted and worshiped by everyone i am a riddle to myself prattling was my profession preaching is my profession now and i know practice should be my future job but everywhere i earned a lot so far and squandered it all in the community i am by training a religious man by experience a vedantin by inclination a bhakta in temperament a karma yogi in practice an integral yogi my faith is in democracy i am convinced by socialism habituated to communism and i am committed to the impossible theory of love all thick skinned hard boned i have a mail of laughter to cover and protect both my head and heart and so stabs do not penetrate me spears do not cleave me and whippings do not lash me i eat and drink take regular baths and sleep wear clothes have no jatta work for 18 to 19 hours a day and preach the rest of the time and when audience are not available of course i preached myself I have many lovers and many beloveds in this country and abroad. I play the beloved to my lovers and I am an enthusiastic lover to my beloveds. We together thus step ahead and march through love towards the Lord's palace of bliss and wisdom. Your good self may meet me easily in my 35 books or in the puja room of any healthy young Indian, be a Hindu, Christian or a Muslim. The white men adore me the yellow men recognize me the brown men worship me and the black ones love me My teacher was divinely sweet incandescent and noble soul and I must tell you of him when you grow a bit more May I hope to hear from you often plenty of the similar rubbish but sprinkled with more and more of sensible stuff try you can don't be shy this is how everyone grows And when you are maintaining an ideal, let not the ideal be a small ideal. Because you may get it. There afterwards in life you are dead. You have nothing to do. Never. Keep the goal highest. So high that you will never reach. Swamiji, why should I keep an ideal which I cannot reach? Ah, reaching the ideal is not the goal. striving to reach it that is the moment when you grow <laughs>